what's on your mind Kinda wish you would give me a sign Oh baby, I'm lost in translation I'm trying to read between the lines Can't let the moment pass me by Tell me what are you saying I'm lost in translation It's kinda cold in here What's good YouTube? It's your boy Alexo back it again with another reaction video today. We're gonna to be checking out Triple Eyes. We got three brand new videos on the Triple Eyes channel. We got a Dita dance cover, we got an Adia dance cover, and we got an EG dance cover. I think these are the full dance clips that were used in the teaser because we saw like snippets of them performing, but I think this is like the actual like full performances. And they're doing more than just one song, they're doing the two three different songs and one one dance cover at first i was deciding whether to upload these as three separate videos three different reactions but i think i'm just gonna make i think i'm just gonna make it one video why not triple eyes marathon let's dive in okay there's a viewer warning Okay. Okay. Dude, it's been literally 26 seconds. Power. Oh, oh, my God. Man, even if it's just her only, like this is not, this is literally a solo type performance, but she's literally lighting up the stage right now. Oh, dang. Okay, we got some song change. Dude, her eye contact is literally like deadly. You know what I'm saying? She's so fine. This is it's, it's been a while, y'all. Oh, fierce. Dude, her speed is very fast. You know what I mean? Like it's hard to be precise at that speed. It always impresses me how she's able to like move different parts of the bodies at certain times. Like she's doing her feet, but then she's also at the same time be able to do like this, the upper body movements as well. I guess when you reach a certain level of dance ability, it just becomes second nature. Uh, but that's, it's very evident to me that she's obviously reached that level. Dude, oh my, I, it's, I'm gonna stop pausing. I'm sorry, I'm pausing so much, but. She just puts so much into each move. It's just like. Dude, 
it's so clean, it's so... Because usually when it comes to very powerful dances, like, it's easy to make it look clunky because it's like, it's, it's put, taking a lot of energy out of you, you know? Um, but it's so neat. She makes it look so neat. Oh my god, that was the best part. That was the highlight. That was everything. Wait, what? Oh my god, it's not over yet. And those transitions between each song was seamless. Dude, the hair, like the bit. I love this hairstyle, by the way. Oh my god. So she danced to one, two, Three different songs. She's danced for four minutes straight, yet she looks like she just started dancing. That's some serious stamina. Four minutes? I mean, I know dances are tip, like a, a song is typically like three minutes, four minutes, but she had to do three different dances at three different energy levels. That's not an easy task to do. This is like criminally underrated, 44,000 views, like, I know we can do so much better than that, guys. 44,000. I mean, I know it just came out yesterday, but come on, man. All right, let's. We're gonna move on to Arias. Um, she's doing Unforgiven and Synchronized. So she's doing La Seraphim and an excellent song. You got another uh, warning. Y'all hear that? They literally called the ambulance because, I mean, the fire truck because this is literally on fire. I feel like I'm hypnotized. I, I can't, my eyes can't read the screen. She performs the song like it's her own song, which I love. She's really owning up to the concept and like... She's really making the most out of the performance. Her visual is literally insane, like... <sighs> How did she get there so fast? What the heck? It was like 0.5 milliseconds. Oh god. This is interesting, because I haven't seen her perform this I haven't seen any Exxon member perform this song alone. She, her position has to be like one of the main dancers in Exxon, right? Main rapper. That comes as a surprise. Oh, 
Oh, actually, I think Isha is one of the main dancers, but I was gonna... And Nova's dancer as well, but... I think dancing comes down to so many things in addition to just like the physical moves themselves. It's like the aura that you emit. Ready, action. It literally. So much of the dancing is in the eyes when, when I watch her performance. Not to say her physical movements are uh, lacking at all, like they're great. She's very precise, she's very... Do I have to say more? Not really. Yeah, I gotta say like the, da the dance moves themselves, like, they're clean, you know? But for me, I think the most noticeable thing in her performance specifically is the stage presence. I will say that to the end of time. Stage presence, that's her specialty. The thing that was so surprising was the fact that I saw on the profile that she's not one of the main dancers, which I, like, forgot about. I was like, is that... Is she really not one of the main dancers? But what this shows when you watch a video of her dancing by herself is that she's able to hold her own dancing to her own group song but just by herself that is challenging not just for rookies but for for idols that have been debuted for years now you know you don't see that you don't you don't see it often because i i don't know i think companies don't really want to take that risk but i think it's a risk worth, worth taking when you have talent like this okay we got eg now perfect night lots of less iphone Okay. Dang, she's smooth. I love the spunk. Dang. This, she just makes you want to get up and dance with her, you know what I mean? There's like different um, charms to each video, you know? I, re I realize EG is smiling a lot, which, like, everyone has a different approach, you know? Like, the, the previous video we watched, it was a lot more serious, like, Adi was a lot more serious. Um, but it's also the song selection, too, like, Perfect Night is one of those one of the songs, you know? Okay. Oh, we're switching it up, by the way. That was a 180 switch. Very fast as well. She's very good at like the upper body, like with all the hand tutting and like the rotations and stuff. She's particularly good at those things. What song is this? The song is Walk on the Walk 
Is this an iChon song? It's a good song. She's just vibing. Dang. Okay, I like how I like how the ending was kind of just dedicated to her, you know, just just vibing out. Like that last portion was a little less choreography oriented and it was kind of more just like her feeling the music and we were really able to see that. I'm pretty sure that last song is an I Chillin' song. It just it just really came off that way, like she was performing one of her songs. Like I think it's maybe just because how comfortable she looked while performing it. I wanna know what's on your mind. Kinda wish you would give me a sign, oh baby. I'm lost in translation. I'm trying to read but 